Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, like it says in the title, we are going to be getting Riptide Trident. Now, sorry about the cut off last episode, my phone ran out of battery. Um, so I'm basically going to explain what we did. We got more netherite and I uh, put netherite on everything you see here. That's what we did. That's literally it. And uh, then Raptor came on uh, later and he got himself some netherite. Totally wasn't me, no. Wasn't me at all. Uh, so, like I said, guys, today we're going to be getting our Riptide Trident. We already have our Poseidon's Dinner Fork. And uh, it seems Raptor is getting abducted there. So, let's get into it. I've already got this Trident because I killed it earlier. Um, and it drops. So, oh, oh, I'll need to take those off. Um, so, Trident drop rates. First thing you're going to need to do is find a Trident Drowned. These are much easier to find on Bedrock Edition, and much harder to find on Java Edition. So, it's also much harder to get a Trident on Java Edition. Uh, on Java, you have a... I think it's a 1 in 20 chance for a Drowned to spawn with a Trident. And then, if you have no looting, it's 8.5% chance for it to drop. If you have looting 1, it's 9.5, looting 2, 10.5, looting 3, 11.5% chance to drop. Uh, no idea why all of this rubbish is out here. Yeah, I don't know. Also, you'll see I've upped my render distance. Um, I can actually see all the way to the village over there. It's at 28 chunks right now, which is actually my recommended. Now, here is a drowned, if you guys don't know. This is a drowned. You kill them. They're basically underwater zombies. Now, they occasionally spawn with tridents. I don't know the spawn right for Bedrock Edition, just no Java Edition. Now, on Bedrock Edition, with loot, with no looting, tridents have a 15% chance to drop. Then, uh, they have, uh, with looting 1, they have a 17% chance. With looting 2, they have a 20% chance. And with looting 3, they have a 25% chance to upload. Uh, sorry about that little notification, guys. Just because I'm installing the game right now. Which I believe you'll see on my second channel. I'm actually going to um, abandon my second channel for the time being. Oh, there's one with a trident. Let's go in on it. Now, you can see they have the trident in their hand. They will throw the trident. So, I'm just going to put my shield up. Now, I'm just going to murder them. And they dropped the trident. That's amazing. So here we have another trident. We're going to go to the enchant... Oh, this guy has a trident as well. How generous of you, sir. How very gen... Get out. You did not drop the trident. I do not want you. You are a disgrace to your kind. Right. Uh, anyone else here? I love having full netherite. It feels so good. It's just like so powerful. Yeah, that shulk, that um, Nautilus shell just completely uh, despawned right in front of me as I was about to pick it up. So that's nice. Oh, nice. Raptor's just got a trident. He's also hunting. Um, I'm just going to combine these. And see how much we have. Okay, so this is nearly full durability now. So. Oh, Trident. Hello. I'm so glad I have Respiration. Otherwise, this would be so much harder. No Trident. There's a ravine down here. Oh no, it's not a ravine, it's a cave. I need oxygen. Combine the bad durability tridents. And then you'll get a slightly better durability trident. Sadly, guys, on the... Uh, Bedrock Edition, baby drowns do not hold um, tridents, but they can actually hold and throw 
on Java Edition. Things are a lot harder on Java. Only on Java Edition, though. Oh, Trident. Is this going to do it for me? Oh, I'm not going to do it. Raptor, uh, meet back up with the base. I might be able to make a full trident with yours. Uh, you can see that uh, mob spawner there. With its nice railroad going up there. Uh, what me and Leon have been thinking is instead of making a railroad all the way to places like Spawn and the village, instead we could just uh, go mine a load of ice and make a massive ice bridge there. So yeah, we might be doing that. So we'll be doing that sometime in the future. Uh, could be soon. It'll be in the 30s, considering this is episode 28. So guys, in two episodes time, episode 30, we are going to be going to the Nether Fortress. So I hope you guys are looking forward to that. Okay, Raptor, I am here. Please can I have your tridents? Okay. Okay guys, so Raptor's given me them. And now I'm going to combine the best durability trident with our trident right now. And full durability trident. This is so good. Uh, Raptor can have that if you want. So now we're going to go over to the enchanting table. And see what enchantments we can get on it. Hopefully Riptide. I just triggered a raid by accident. Um, we're going to have to defend the VTC now. Because this is technically a village. And it would be at night, wouldn't it? Great. Oh, we're in full another right. Who cares? Where are they? Over by the church. There. Actually, I'm going to kill one with looting. This is also a good way to gain emeralds. Uh, for the mending. Oh, apparently they spawned right on... Oh, shoot. Do you, do you guys mind? Do, do, do you guys mind? Thank you. Alright, looks like we're going to be doing a raid before we uh, get this trident done. So, yeah, it's also Raptor's birthday on the day we're filming this. So, happy birthday to him in the comments. Um... Yeah, so this is a nice birthday present for him, since he is a pillager. South. No, it's actually... Yeah, this is south. I think. Okay. They're not. I, I reckon I can 1v1 a Ravager. Oh, you're 1v1-ing the Ravager. Got to make sure to collect all the emeralds. Another one dead. Oh, actually, I'm going to collect these crossbows. So that I can... Make a god crossbow. I can actually one-shot these zombies with this sword, so that's nice. Right, I want to 1v1 the Ravager this time. Oh wait, there is no Ravager this round, it's the next round. Yeah. Yeah, only four pillagers spawn. So, because the witches don't spawn anymore for some weird reason. Maybe they got kicked out of the Elder ranks. Right, let's see. Where's the last slot? Because we didn't use the glitch, because this wasn't intentional. This is only going to be a five round wave. Five wave round. I'm, I'm 1v1ing this guy. 1v1ing, 1v1ing, 1v1ing. Okay. Oh, shoot. Uh, we're at the VTC. 
And that's them dead. Okay, um, Leon is on his way to uh, help us out finish this uh, one remaining pillager. Uh, we've done all five rounds. I reckon he's in that cave. Uh, I'm going to combine these crossbows. I noticed I was dying. But I wanted the crossroads. I have a full crossbow right here. So Raptor says it's going to be a Vindicator that's left. Oh, I see them. Going to finish them off ranged. Hey, here are the village. Yeah, you guys get the Mending Villager. I think his trades are at 26. Why? Oh, it'll be the fireworks. It'll be the fireworks. They're dying of the fireworks, really. Dishwasher. Okay. He's upstairs. The mending guy's upstairs. Yes. No. Yes. I give up with this guy. Guys, the mending village is dead. Oh, it took me six days to get that mending villager. Time to get back on the grind. So guys, like I said, time to get this impaling, no, actually not impaling, uh, Riptide Trident. I'm going to take a cut till I get Riptide, I'm just sad at this point. In fact, you know what, I'm just going to end the episode here. This is just so sad. Uh, see, see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed.